Look at these beautiful roses. Awesome. Look at all these chickens. <laughs> Hey guys, how's it going? My name is Alex and, and welcome back everybody to the Minecraft Survival Let's Play. Um, as you guys can see, um, in the last episode, uh, there wasn't as much work done because I was kind of just going around and talking to you guys. And uh, yeah, that's kind of what was happening. But um, today's episode, I do have an idea and it's going to be awesome. We're going to work back in the enchantment room. I have an awesome design to work on because I did a practice design and it turned out pretty sweet. So we're going to work on that and I'm going to show you guys quickly around here what I did on uh, one of the short live streams I had. So as you can see, there is a pathway now. I also changed up the staircase and I also put this middle like type of uh, little pillar here which looks pretty cool and I kind of have these pathways going down with some little street lamps here and it pretty much continues all the way down to the farm and that's pretty much it so in future episodes and things like that we're gonna continue to work on this pathway I also want to work on adding um, around here basically like just wheat farm so instead of grass it's gonna be a fence around it and uh, just kind of like wheat growing so it'll look pretty nice I think um, and some of these ideas are like inspired from like SG um, maps because like some of them have really unique designs and I thought they were pretty cool um, But so yeah, we're gonna go to the enchantment room. I want to work on that um, And it's pretty cool because I have some cool plans Also, there is kind of like a big change in this room because that's kind of what I'm trying to focus on um, As you guys can see I took down the middle walls here and pretty much I did change the layout of The chests there's now wood going down as pillars instead of the other 1.8 block Which kind of was bugging me because I didn't really like it as much as I used to and this just really keeps it simple and all that. Also, I did expand back here. Um, before, it was nothing. It was just some wasted space, and it was much smaller, like, uh, chest storage. So I wanted to make it bigger because eventually we might expand because I want to have each chest specifically for one Minecraft item. So it's going to be a big expansion eventually, but I also have the upstairs level, which we can expand. And I've just kind of been using the uh, um, the frames here to kind of, like, signal what type of items are there. Like, that's the chicken item. So, yeah, actually, I do need food. So we're going to grab some. I don't think I have any. Nope. So let's grab some food. It's gonna get some chicken. I guess that should be good enough. And I'm gonna show you guys what we're gonna work on for the enchantment room, uh, which is gonna be pretty good because it's gonna turn out really well. Um, all I did was I actually just brought down these uh, bookshelves here uh, into the ground because it goes with one of the designs I'm working for. And I just pretty much kept it simple, um, simple as that. So I'm just gonna store whatever junk items I have in here for now. Just keep the inventory clean for you guys to see how I'm building and things like that. So let's keep everything organized and clean for you all. Um, there we go. And yeah, so right now I need some of this wood. I need the jungle wood, which is this one here. Perfect. And I do need to make ourselves, um, what's it called? One of those, oh, I'm forgetting the term right now, but I know how to make it, so that's a good thing. So when I make it, there we go. Uh, shears, there we go. I can't believe I forgot about that. Pretty funny. Um, so I need the shears to get some leaves, um, and then that can go through for our design. So let's actually get some leaves now since, uh, you know, we're kind of close to the outside. So I'm going to go with, let's go any any leaves really. It doesn't matter actually now that I think about it. And it's turning night. So we're going to have to go and get ourselves uh, some rest quickly. So let's grab whatever we can here. There we go. I think that should be, yeah, 23. Actually, no, I'm going to go safe and just take as many as I can right now. Because I don't want to come back outside here. It just doesn't want, I just don't want to have that have that have that happen gosh I can't speak all right let's go uh, back to our little area and get that all sorted out alrighty so pretty much we're gonna have the jungle planks kind of going all around it's just gonna go all around as so um, just kind of covering up this wall just kind of give it a design and then we're gonna use the actual leaves to make a cool pattern including some stone brick stairs um, and you'll see how that's gonna turn out I actually got inspired from uh, Google images some people like putting actually like enchantment designs of how they have their rooms and this just inspired me So that's kind of the reason why I just wanted to make this room for this uh, Design specifically because it just looks really cool. Um, they didn't use the wood I'm using but I just like it because it's pretty cool and it's kind of unique. So um, that's that uh, Now we just need the stairs. So we're just gonna go all the way. Oh, oh not like that. Not definitely not like that We're just gonna go all the way around like so and pretty much same for the top and if you guys ever want to follow this design, design, I hope I'm not going too fast for you guys. Um, should be pretty even. I mean, the amount of speed I'm going at. But it's kind of simple. You know, I don't want to get it too overdone. Because I do want to maybe work a bit on that uh, path design I had in mind. Uh, but I also want to show you, if I have enough time, 
the area I'm working on for the cabin, um, which is gonna be pretty cool. So let's make ourselves these stairs because I don't have as many as I thought I should have had. Um, just finishing up the top here like that. Oh, not like that actually, all right. All right guys, sorry about that. Uh, we're back, uh, I just had to do something, um, but there we go. So pretty much that's what I wanted to finish. Um, I just, just had to go back to the design quickly just to make sure that um, you know I was doing things right. So it is fine how it is right now because I was just a bit worried because I didn't have enough space here for the sides, but that's absolutely fine because it's completely fine. Like I was looking at the design and kind of saying, okay, I can kind of makeshift this and make it work fine. So right now, uh, the next design is going to be putting the leaves in. So we're gonna start with the middle right here because I can kind of see the center of it. And I'll show you guys how it's gonna look. It's pretty simple. It's just the leaves going down here. And with that, it just looks really cool, my opinion. Uh, I don't know what you guys think, but I just like it a lot. Uh, I, I wanna make sure I have everything. Okay, it just should be fine. We could put it like that, there we go. Looks a little bit, whoa, that was a drastic change. What What the heck was that? Why is it so, oh, okay, there. <laughs> okay, because I don't have torches. Yeah, that's why I had the brightness on the gamma. Uh, do I have any torches in here? Oh, fantastic. All right, sweet. That's why we need torches, everybody. Uh, torch there, torch there, and one in the middle. So as you can see, it just looks really nice, has a good design to it. Um, and overall, I think it'll look pretty cool. So as you can see, this is the center here. Should be, yeah, I think yeah, I think that's good. Yep, should be fairly good. And then the leaves go back here like so. Um, let me make sure, yeah, it's center. Okay, good, I was a bit worried. So pretty much that's gonna be designed. There's nothing more that goes to this. Uh, and if you guys, let me know in the comment section, what do you guys think? Now, what I could do is down here have like waterfall. Like that's kind of what the picture has, but I can easily just change that and just leave it simple because I don't really need to go too extreme with the design kind of like simple, kind of keeps it clean. And I think it looks really nice. And the flooring, we're obviously gonna go with this type of flooring because um, that would look best. So we're just gonna fix that right now. And then I have this other room, which I have no idea what I wanted to use. Now, do I have at least one, a few, any more torches? Oh, why'd I do that? Oh, there, nope, there we go. I need like a few more torches. I think I have some coal maybe uh, laying around here somewhere. No, I do not. Okay, uh, maybe I have some coal here. If I don't have any coal, it's just gonna be sad. Um, that does kind of like go back to the area when I lost like all my items for some reason. Um, yeah, I don't have anything up there for sure. Wow, we're really low on torches unless I'm just completely missing a lot over here. I do have sticks, but I don't have coal. Oh, that's a bummer. Uh, I'll probably just like take a few from here. Yeah, there we go. And I'll just place whatever I can. So you guys can see something back here. It's kind of dark. I should have just not put the gamma like down to brightness, lower to brightness. But this room, I think we're gonna do like an armor stand room. Uh, that was my idea because 1.8 has the armor stand room. And then down here, I was thinking of like actually just building some area for like a downstairs. Um, so I have no idea um, what the I, what, what the plan's gonna be for that, but we'll see, we'll see. You guys have to let me know. Um, and then I will quickly, if I have time, show you guys the area or the location for the cabin because that's kind of been decided um, as for right now. It could change, uh, but I wanna work on that as soon as I can because I just really wanna get into the snow biome. It's uh, really good looking and I haven't really worked in a snow biome before. Uh, man, it's so good to have everything organized. It's really a good feeling. Um, so as you can see, I'm just gonna carry on and just pretty much continue this flow of like one simple color, like of like the planks um, for the flooring because I think it just overall, it just gives it a better look. Um, in general for like anything because it, it feels like too Unorganized when it's like all over the place different floorings, but again, that's just my opinion So yeah, don't don't like quote me on it um, Let's just finish up this just because I want it to look decent And now I also need a design for pretty much like a wall here because there's gonna be a wall here So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to get some of where is I thought I had a junk chest here Actually, I could just use this and just make more of them uh, I think I'm gonna go with stone brick just because it looks nice and you can kind of like blend it up with anything and the stone brick would be right like between here because this is gonna be where the, ch the basically the entrance is gonna be let me actually continue this here so it's easy for us to see um, just put the stone like that this is so that we could just see how it's gonna look because again you guys have to understand what I'm trying to build so like that and whatever I'll just put those there just why not YOLO um, so there is gonna be a entrance, I think by two. I don't know if that's the best idea, maybe like this. So that's gonna be right there. So maybe by four or no, 
let's see, because I'm kind of just making this design up by three. So it'll be pillars going by three. So one, two, three. And then we need a space of three. Ooh, but the thing is, this one's not even with that side. All right, so I'm not gonna bother with this right now because I need some time to kind of think how I want to design it. So I'm not gonna bother with that because that was not my plan, but the idea is this room is complete and I'm liking it except for this flooring here needs to be changed. I'm not liking that, that I don't like. This has to be changed and now we can get better enchants too. Now, I think we can go with stone brick. Well, let's just go with the, uh, just go with the wood planks because that was our idea at the end of the day, kind of keeping that theme. Oh, that looks so cool, guys. What do you guys think? Let me know in the comment sections. I would love to know your um, comments on this, you know, your ideas, your thoughts, anything. So let me know. I think it looks good, you know, for what it is for the enchantment room. Nothing big, nothing dramatic. Eventually, maybe we can have a pressure plate where these, like, kind of, like, rise up by one level. Uh, that could be pretty cool, including the um, enchantment table because I see that on servers now, now time. So, yeah, that could be something I could be looking into. Um, oh, also, do I have any more wool? Uh, okay, sweet. We do have wool. Uh, let me go kill some sheep. Or no, get some flowers. <laughs> yeah, I killed enough sheep already. Oh, let's get some flowers because I do. I forgot about one more design that I really wanted to add. Oh, that looks so cool. So let me, let's me let get some sleep quickly. And then also for this house, we're going to have to design it for sure because it doesn't look good. We're pretty much it's going to be like a floor plan, like a nice design, fireplace, sitting area. Um, and it's going to be a house that we're not really going to use besides sleeping. So yeah, um, that's just something I need to kind of clear out. We'll do that in a future episode. It's also working down here for like a farm, not like a farm, but more for like a design, like a wheat, air, like basically a hill of wheats um, because like it looks really cool. You know, I just don't want the grass. I kind of want to go a little bit with some design to it. Like if you guys play on SG servers and you guys see like a farm kind of like next to a pathway, that's kind of want to want to go for. So I think it'll look pretty cool. So I'm just getting some of these roses for the red carpet that I want to place on top of the enchantment table because I think it just look really cool and I think you guys might like it as well. I think it's gonna look pretty cool. And also this little tower is gonna be repeated over here um, in one of the future episodes. So that is something we should be looking forward to as well. But let's craft ourselves these carpets since we are here. Oh wait, let's actually get the, there we go, rose red. I think this should be enough. I don't know actually, it maybe is because I think it makes, yeah, there we go. Okay, 12, so we cannot screw this up. Uh, actually, I don't think it's 12. Maybe it is, maybe not. Maybe we're gonna have to go get some more roses. Oh yeah, we definitely have to. Okay, well, we need four more, but as you can see, that's the idea. Um, I think we have some time to go grab some. Um, but while we make our way, let's do this. Let's actually, actually no, I wanna go find those red roses. Where are they? We're gonna have to take all of them. Oh, there's like a whole field of them down there. <laughs> Sweet, so we don't have to go too far. And it's kind of like in the direction where the snow biome is. So I'll show you guys that area. Uh, oh, hey sheep, how's it going? Sorry about killing like, your whole family. <laughs> Hey, look, another sheep. There's a lot of sheeps around here, actually. All right, that's good, that's good. So that means they're still alive. They're not extinct by now. The fox has kind of like left some mercy on them. <laughs> they're like, I was like pretty much like, you know what? I'll let your kingdom. Oh my gosh, there's actually a lot of sheep. Are they like, okay, yeah, that one's like giving me a death stare, I'm out. <laughs> they're like all chasing me down. Like, yeah, you, you pretty much just took out a whole entire village of ours of sheeps. Um, but yeah, they're like, but it, yeah, it's, it's all cool. Like if we don't, if you don't take any more of our sheeps out, we should be okay. We'll, we'll call it peace. I don't know about that. <laughs> all right, let's get some more in here. There we go. And I think that should be way more than enough. Nine. Okay, perfect. So the area is complete. Uh, oh no, 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 not like that. Not like that. And bam, voila guys. What do you guys think about that? It looks just really cool. Like has a royal theme to it. I'll take these out as well because it doesn't go with the theme right now until I get a design for it. But yeah, I'm liking this a lot. It looks really cool. Definitely has a nice theme. And again, each room has its own colorful theme to it. So I'm really happy with how this turned out. So pretty cool. Now I'm gonna just drop off whatever junk items I have in here. Um, but yeah, I actually shouldn't do that. I should have like a junk chest unit for now because I don't really stay too organized when it's like on screen because I'm like in the rush of doing things properly. But uh, let's see, we're not gonna do the farm, but I wanted to show you guys the location quickly and that's where we're gonna end off the episode. So I'm gonna go, uh, I should get some more food. Um, no, 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 if anything, I'll just kill some like pigs or cows. But I wanna show you guys the location of the house. We're gonna be kind of making our vacation house into the winter biome. Um, because I just absolutely love the winter biome now that I look at it. It has just a really cool feel to it, especially if you build like a nice wooden cabin. 
Be quiet, sheep. I'm talking. <laughs> All right, so, oh, there's a whole area of roses. So we're going to quickly get to that area, show it to you guys, and then I'll finish off the episode, and I'll see you guys in another episode of the Survival um, Minecraft Let's Play. I know a lot of you guys are enjoying it, and that's huge. So thank you for all the support on that. It means a lot. It really does, guys. So um, with that being said, there's going to be a lot more of it. And once we reach a milestone maybe of 20 episodes or 30 or 50, I'll release the seed. I know a lot of you guys wanted to kind of build along with it, but um, I think it just gives it more significance once we reach a certain milestone um, and I release the seed. It would just feel cool. Oh, man, this snow biome is awesome. Um, and also we're going to have to make a Oktoberfest feel um, down at our house, get a farm going. If I'm not mistaken, the location should be down here, which is not too far from home. Um, oh, good thing I brought some type of food with me. Um, oh, there it is. Sweet. So it's actually pretty close. So I just built the foundation, and I pretty much just kind of kept it simple because that's kind of kind of what it's going to be. We're going to have a fireplace and pretty much just keep it simple. Look at these beautiful roses. Awesome. Look at all these chickens. <laughs> no, okay. That, whoa, whoa. My mouse just spazzed out. They were pretty nice chickens. Okay. Wait, which way is home? Oh, that just messed me up because... Oh, wait, I said I was going to end off the episode here, but I just got completely messed up because of the mouse spaz. Oh, it's up this hill. Okay, perfect. So as I walk my way back home, I hope you guys enjoyed today's episode. Um, if you don't make it back to the house, I'm probably... I'm most... You know what? I'm going to end it at this place because I like it here. Um, if you guys did enjoy today's episode, make sure you guys all hit that like button. The goal is 100. And make sure you guys are... If you guys are new to this, subscribe. And I'll catch you guys. Look at all those roses. My gosh. Uh, make sure you guys subscribe as well. I'll catch you guys later with more Minecraft Survival Let's Play. Peace out, guys.